going on, everybody? I got my daily with me. Last week, I got new tires for the extra rims that I had. Right now, I'm just dialing in my fitment, just making sure everything's good before I actually go for a test drive. But as you can see, I'm with a pretty meaty tire. Um, this is a 17 by 9. Uh, the tire is a 550. That was pretty good. The last setup I ran was a 205 40, and I loved it. But I'm not really trying to be hella low. I want to still have like a lot of tire, like, you know, a lot of meat. So I went with these. Um, I'm digging the look. Uh, I'm adding some camber in the rear just because this, these wheels are too wide for this car, but it's still gonna look pretty nice. Um, you guys are gonna see the end result. And yeah, hey guys, I got the camber in the rear settled. Uh, I think I'm pretty happy right there. I don't want to go any more camber just because that'll be kind of overkill. But I'm happy with that right there. As you can see. All right, so because I'm happy with how that camber is, um, I had everything loose over here. I don't know if you guys could see in my flashlight. So this right here my camera arm and that's what I'm adjusting so all I'm gonna do is tighten these these jam bolts so that obviously it doesn't adjust while I'm driving but I'm gonna get that done hop on to the other side and then I'll show you guys that and then also before I tighten this I need to measure from this mount to the back mount to see how long the overall length of it so I can match it to the other side. And it should be pretty close to when, for when I get my alignment. All right, how's it going, everybody? I finally got it done. Um, I didn't really record much, but here she is. Um, I still need to get upper control arms for my camber. But other than that, this thing is sitting how I want it to sit. You can see the camber in the rear. Pretty good. I just need to correct the front, obviously, and then put more. And uh, this is how she's sitting. Really digging it, just for the daily. It's looking good. What's going on, everybody? I got the daily here with me. I don't know if you guys remember, but I think it was the, the video before. I showed you guys putting this lip on the coupe. I'm actually gonna go with a different front end for the, the coupe. So I'm not really gonna be running the 01 to 02 bumper. So I'm going with something a little bit different, but I'm gonna try to throw this lip on, on the sedan bumper and see how that goes. It should kind of fit kind of be a little snug snug fit but i'll make it work um this is what we're looking at so i'm gonna take the front bumper off um get it onto the workbench and then i'm gonna start putting the lip on and then making sure everything's all tidy and everything so that's that um you guys are gonna see that process and anything along with it so yeah let's get into it
Um, I got the lip pretty much on. Um, I got this side fastened down. This side, it's getting a little tight. So I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna heat this area up and then like loosen it up so that it could like form to the bumper better. And I'll just slowly, slowly, slowly move this line here. And that should be able to do it to mount it. And then from the top, I'm gonna put some more screws. So yeah, hi right, everybody. I got the, the lid pretty much on. I just gotta adjust it while it's on the car so that there's actually points that will hold it down instead of tearing the whole lip off. So. All right guys, here's how the sedan's looking. I'm really digging the look. So yeah, here's how the sedan's looking. Um, the front lip is for a 0102 front bumper. Um, it's not the same, but it's close enough to make it work. Um, obviously, it's not perfect, but because I had extra lip, I just like, you know, it was like, might, might as well, you know? Like, so, I have a rear lip coming. Um, it's on the way, it should be here sometime this week. And then I'm gonna order some side skirts pretty soon. But aside from all the cosmetic stuff, um, I got <clears throat> a clutch on the way. Um, I have to go to pick and pull to get a couple things just so that when I do the swap, this thing is ready to go. Um, yeah, so once I do all that, I get the, the motor in and then pull this motor out and then we're ready to work on the coupe. I can't wait to start working on the motor for the coupe because I get to really take my time <clears throat> and you know, spend the right money on the right parts so that we're ready to go and we have the best of the best and you know, we could at, at least make 500 to 600 horsepower. So yeah, um, I'm really excited for what's coming to the channel and to the Accords. Uh, I really wanna do something unique with these cars just because like not a lot of people even like boost these cars i mean it's been done obviously but there's not a huge like selection of information and videos of these cars so here i am all right guys one thing i forgot to mention about what i got done to the sedan off camera um i got upper control arms for my camera in the front um, that's why the fitment is so much more cleaner um i got new uh, what is it called? Radius rod bushings up in the front just because there was a clunk going on and I got new I got one new uh, What is it called? Motor mount rear motor mount just because the Motor mounts on this baby right now They're fucked up like you can like you can literally feel the engine jolt from the ins from inside the cabin and yeah, so that's why I gotta take care of it. But aside from that, like this thing is driving pretty fucking good. And I've been loving how it's been treating me. I just can't wait to get that new motor in. And shit, we, fight. we might go on a, a road trip with this thing. But aside from that stuff coming in, um, obviously, like I said, I did the upper control arms. Um, I got these chrome, chrome moldings for the top. And then I obviously put the, the trunk trim on. Um, I gotta take that badge off. Get rid of that because it's already coming off. And then I gotta reinstall my Honda badge. Um, that's gonna be it for today's video. Um, I hope you guys like how the, the front end's looking. Um, once I get the lip in, you guys can see that. And then hopefully the side skirt pretty soon. And then from there, I just, I really want to do the new mirrors with the RL um, side markers and shit. So you guys will see that. Um, aside from that, I'll see you guys soon. Hope you guys like the videos. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.